Well, good morning. I am here in Tony's Town Square Diner, and we are here for the Taste of Magic Kingdom VIP tour. I don't think that there is another tour that was better made for us, so um, I am really excited to show you what's on this tour today. And uh, I'm here hanging out with my friends, uh, Tramp and Lady, of course. Um, this, uh, this is a really fun restaurant, actually. If you've never been here, you should come check it out. Bring your loved one and share the meatballs. We were told to meet at Tony's Town Square restaurant to check in for our tour right at 9 a.m. It was bizarre seeing the restaurant so empty, but it makes sense since they don't serve breakfast there. Speaking of, after we checked in for our tour, the eating began immediately with some Mickey-shaped pastries. We never passed an opportunity to eat anything Mickey-shaped, but to save room for the rest of the tour, Mom and I decided to share one. They were quite good, crispy on the outside, fluffy on the inside. Then we headed off on our tour route, which began in a backstage area off of Main Street, USA. Unfortunately, since filming backstage is forbidden, I could not bring you along. But we made a quick stop in Casey's Corner to see the tiniest working kitchen in Disney World. Again, this was considered a backstage area, so no filming was permitted. But we will be coming back here later today to sample the fare. Our next stop was at Jungle Skipper Canteen, where we saw some heavy nods to a classic Disney attraction. But we actually have four offices. Um, Skipper Mark, Skipper Harbor, and Skipper Bill. Um, so those three are three Imagineers that helped create the Jungle Cruise. Aside from the Mickey pastries, this was our first food stop of the day. We tried the curried vegetable cruise stew and the Venezuelan cachapa appetizer. This ended up being my favorite savory stop of the whole tour. I'll point out my favorite sweet when it comes on. We are going to have an opportunity here in just a moment. You're going to have a chance to talk to an actual Disney chef. Central American food, all the way to Africa and China as well. So the great thing about our menu is that it's very eclectic, so you can just choose whichever region you would like, and we have it here for you. All right, Mom, we're about to taste the Dole Whip. What's your thoughts on Dole Whip before you taste it? I'm a Dole Whip hater. She is. I've had it once, wasn't thrilled. Maybe I've had it twice. All I know is it's just too tart for me. I'm an ice cream girl. I don't hate it. It's just not as, I don't think it lives up to the hype. Well, I'm gonna give it a taste because our tour guide's still talking. So I'm gonna get both sides in this. What kind do we have today? I think uh, raspberry, and was it pineapple? Yeah, traditional, Mix. and then raspberry too. So. so I'm gonna put them together just to see them both together. Cold? Tart? A little tart, sorry. No words, I have no words. <laughs> so, approved or not? Um, I wouldn't buy it. I prefer ice cream, but it's not bad. Better, it's better than I remember. I, I like hate it on it more than it needs to be hated on, I think. Well, there you go, people. That's our consensus. Yes. This is a tool that you need a wheelbarrow pushing around. You're not carrying that thing around by itself. Uh, so, like, so how do we get them so big? These are male turkeys. Most of the turkeys you buy in the store uh, are female turkeys. So that's why these are so much larger. Mm -hmm. All right, so here in Liberty Square, the pavement is different again, and that's because in, in this time period, they did not have indoor toilets. And so what people would do, they had buckets and they would throw them out in the water. And so this represents the land and the water. That's what this is. I'm not going to elaborate anymore <laughs> because this is a food tour, okay? Mm. So we're going to head on inside. We're going to head over this way. And... Try to balance out the savory and sweet. Yeah, it's great. And Jeanette, I have yours right here. Delicious. Okay, this is uh, local honey we use. Whatever we can, we use the local honey, the shallots, apple cider vinegar, olive oil, and salt and pepper. That's, the, that's all it is for that dressing. The sweet that you taste it from the honey and the shallots, because we roast the shallots for eight hours. Very slow oven, so we get all the sweetness from the uh, shallow bean and red. Thank you. Oh, 
close-up action right here for you. Mm. That is delicious. The dishes were ripe. <laughs> Thank you. Mm, I'm probably gonna need a nap. <laughs> Look inside. Are you busy? Yeah, yeah. I'm trying to get to it. Can you see it? A little berry business. Mm, one more. Is it very delicious? Ooh, there oh, it is. yeah. You like it, Mom? Yeah, I do. I wasn't sure with the description. It's, but it's light. It's good. It's just it does taste like cheesecake, but I feel like it should be more like cake cake the way it looks. Yeah. 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 Approved. Approved. Alrighty, so we just finished up our Taste of Magic Kingdom VIP tour. As you see from my VIP card, I'm a VIP, obviously. Um, but I am not too full. I am appropriately full, I think, and I had a really good time on the tour today, so I don't know about you, Mom, what you thought. Did you like it? It was a delicious way to taste our way through Disney. A delightful, delicious yeah. experience. So, um, <laughs> everything was really good. It seems like they've made some updates to the menu recently, and we got to taste a really exclusive dish that's debuting next week, so it's like not even available yet. Like I said, the I eat, baby. Um, but we are going to head back into the park now, so I think we're going to do a few more snacks on our own, so there may be a little bit of continuation here, but I am going to say goodbye to you for now um, and see what other delicious items that we can find that are on our Magic Kingdom bucket list. So stay tuned for a few more adventures. All right, we are on to our next snack attack. We've ridden ride, or a ride, and we did the Enchanted Tiki Room, and now we're here a little hungry. So what did you get for us, Mom? We stopped at the Adventureland Spring Roll Cart that mm. is all famous, like the best place to get a good snack. I have snack. not heard of this. It is all over the food blog, so it's definitely one to check out. Um, so I got a sampler platter, of course, because that is my nickname. <laughs> And so I got one is a cheeseburger spring roll, and the other one is, is this one? A, a pepperoni pizza spring roll. And now that we've sat and looked at them so long, I can't remember which one is which. So I would just be surprised. When oh, I we better taste them. All right. Yeah. Well, I'll try this one then. Okay. If I knew which one was pepperoni, I'd dip it in this delicious marinara. But I don't really know. I think this one looks like it's got a pepperoni sticking out, maybe. All right. Well, then I'll try this one. Mm. Cheeseburger? This is definitely the cheeseburger. A little bit of cheesy, Let's get that cheese action. Oh, yeah. Now I see why it's famous. Never have I ever tried them. I'm so glad I did. This delicious. is delicious. All right. Now that we tried the cheeseburger one, let's give this pizza one a try and see how it goes. Let's get that sauce action. Wow. That's delicious, better than any pizza roll I've ever had. Mmm, that's quite the pizza roll you got there. I know, let's look at that cheese. Wow. Snack attack. It's deliciousness. It's a good lunch snack. So yeah, spring roll cart just outside of the entrance to Adventureland. Go get you some. Hey again. It's us. Did you miss us? Uh, we're here. Okay, we're here for another snack break. So we've digested our egg rolls and we're now ready for something sweet. So we went over to Storybook Treats and picked up the Arendelle Aqua Cone. Would you like to taste test this for us, Mom? Yes, it looks delicious. It's apparently cotton candy flavored. Mm -hmm. So I have not had cotton flav flavored, cotton candy flavored ice cream. Here we go. Yep. salty too, classic popcorn. For her, can't go wrong. It's a staple. I've been talking about it the past couple days and now it's finally here. I lost one of these things. Nice, very good. <laughs> All right, see you later. All right, hello again guys. We are stopped for our final snack stop of the day, I think probably before dinner. So um, we are going to show you our last choice, which 
was a choice by mom. So, and we're actually back. It's on my list for a while. Yes, and we're actually back somewhere that we were earlier today. If it looks a little bit familiar in here, so what are we? What are we snacking, mom? We are at Casey's Corner and having the corn dog nuggets and fries and yeah. meal. I noticed you got some cheese sauce. Oh yeah, you gotta get the like fake cheese. Of right? course, not much better than fake cheese in this life. All right, well we're gonna give these a taste test real quick. I'm gonna dunk right in the cheese. Cheese fry. Cheese fry. Just like my county fair. Pretty tasty. Very good. Well, we hope you've enjoyed our food tour of Magic Kingdom today and learned a little bit about the Taste of Magic Kingdom VIP tour that we were on earlier this morning. Hopefully we've made you hungry a little bit and maybe we will see you on the next tour here at Magic Kingdom. So thanks for watching my video. Hit that subscribe button before you head on out of here and we will see you next week for a brand new video. Yeah. Cheers! Cheers! Woo.